For the first time since 1945, Montana and Montana State won't be taken to the football field for their annual rivalry game this fall. The Bobcats and Grizzlies have met 119 times since starting the series in 1897, but the coronavirus pandemic postponed this year's game to next spring. We all uh, wish that uh, we could be a part of the, the game again this week, uh, but I think you know the one thing I want everyone to understand and appreciate is that, hey, uh, that rival will be back. The game and the opportunity to play that game will be back again. That's not going anywhere. The rivalry's not going anywhere. Ione has been a part of the rivalry for nearly 20 years, first playing for the Cats in the series in 2000. He lost his first two Cat Grizz games, but then helped Montana State make history in 2002. When you make that choice to, to go to Montana State or the University of Montana, I mean, you're, you are jumping all in 100% on, on one side or the other. And having made that choice to be a part of Coach Kramer and his staff uh, program in, in 2000, and then two years later being a part of the group that uh, went from 0-11 in 2000 to uh, sharing a Big Sky title in 2002 and reaching that point by beating the University of Montana, who were obviously at the, the peak of their um, program's history at that point, and um, in their stadium in Missoula with the, the weather that it was and the score that it was, a 10-7 to classic Cat Grizz game. And I mean, you just can't. It's tough to, to top that moment. The Bobcats ended 16 years of misery with that 2002 win and have since remained generally competitive against the Grizz. Ione's playing days ended in 2003, and he's been an assistant coach at Montana State since 2005, only skipping the 2017 and 2018 seasons. You're limited to four as a player. I wish that number was higher. I wish you could play it. <laughs> if there was a rule that they could implement where if you play in this game one time, you could play in it forever. Um, and, and I think all of us that have played in this game would, would choose to strap up on, on any given Saturday, no matter how old we were, we'd all come back together and, and try and play in this game one more time. As a coach, Ione has five wins in the series, and two of them specifically stand out in his memory. I think uh, 2010, uh, when we went up in, into Missoula again uh, with uh, Denarius McGee, the quarterback, and, uh, as a young freshman, redshirt freshman, and a really good group of, of seniors, and those guys really did a heck of a job of, of helping lead um, that group uh, with uh, and establish with a young group of players like Denarius and Jody Owens and some other guys that, that helped continue that trend going forward. Uh, and then, obviously, I think just the result that we had last year, that was a great feeling at the end of the day where you just felt like, okay, all this hard work and, and uh, preparation that we put in for this one moment really paid off for our, for our players and our kids and to see their, uh, the joy on their faces. And again, just an unbelievable senior group uh, that uh, now can walk away and, and say that they had claimed victories over the, over the University of Montana four straight times and had never actually lost to Montana uh, in, during their Cat Grizz rivalry.